The Rams traveled up to Hamilton, New York on Tuesday, looking to go 5-3 on the year. And after a slow first half, the Rams came alive in the second as Ryan Rooms gets the layup to pull the Rams to within five. And then Brandon Frazier drains a three to make it a two-point game. Mandel Thomas hits a driving layup and gets fouled, and his three-point play gives Fordham its first lead of the half, 46-45. A few minutes later, Thomas again hits a driving layup to knock the game at 50, and then nails a three-pointer a few minutes later to stop a full game run. Brian Smith then feeds Travion Leonard for the lay-in to pull the Rams to within one, 62-61, with five minutes left, and a Frazier layup two minutes later again pulls the Rams to within one, 64-63. After a Colgate three, Rooms got an old-fashioned three-point play with the basket and the foul. And a Fraser jumper with 138 left gave the Rams a one-point lead, 68-67. After another Colgate three, Leonard tipped in a Thomas miss to tie the game at 70 with 46 seconds remaining. Thomas almost got this acrobatic layup to go in after a steal but he sinks both free throws with 31 ticks on the clock to put Fordham up 72-70. After a Colgate missed three-pointer, the Rams hit their free throws down the stretch, including this one by Thomas with four seconds left to seal the 77-73 Ram win. It was frustrating. Great to see you. Great to see you. No, frustrating, but like I told them, the worst one I ever had is beautiful. So, we're gonna take it. It's a tough place to play. You know, it's a tough trip. Especially tough when you come in here and uh, Team like Kobe, you know, the nation, it's a game. Mm -hmm. The three point percentage is very high. You got to kind of catch up to that speed a little bit after you get And we, we've been playing a lot of zone. So we came out and said, well, let's see what happens with the zone. We tried to make some adjustments to extend, but they did such a good job of moving multiple guys to the perimeter and getting good looks. And what hurt us was we didn't rebound in the zone. So they got eight offensive rebounds in the first half that allowed them to kick out for some great looks. And, you know, they're playing to their strength. They're a really good shooting team. And, you know, he's doing a good job. So, uh, we went man the last 10 minutes of the first half and, and the entire second half. A little more accountability. We were able to defend the strike a little bit more. But, you know, Tillerson's tough. And he comes up that little curl cut. You, know, you don't want to let him shoot it because, heck, he comes into the game shooting like 70% from three. So. And Allison, once you go man, you have to put Smith on Murphy for a costume. Yeah. He takes him down the post. That's a great job. Yeah. Uh, Plus, I didn't know him. He shaved. <laughs> right, right, right. Initially. Yeah. Like, is that Murphy? Yeah. yeah. Uh, talk about uh, oh. Brandon Frazier. Oh. It's Brandon Frazier all the time. But uh, people here don't get a chance to see this. Yeah, he's really developed. He's a pretty good player, obviously. Third team all conference preseason. And, you know, he's. He's doing more of what point guards need to do. He's controlling games. He's picking when to go to the hoop. He's picking when to get people shots. He's understanding personnel better. He's distributing the ball when he needs to, and at times being a little selfish, which we need him to be at times. So I, I thought he had a great second half doing that. He really uh, did a good job. And he's got great size for a point guard, so when he does get in the lane, he can still make plays. Man, no comments. That's a great, a lot of great little plays. He grabbed two loose balls in there. Yeah. Uh, very important loose balls. And I was noticing he usually takes about eight threes a game. He took three or four, but he gets a big one down the stretch there for you. Yeah, I have great confidence in all of them to shoot the ball. He's been a little leg weary. You know, he, he was sick last week, so I don't know if he shaped that yet. I shook him that yet, right? But, uh, yeah, no, I mean, they have the green light. Him, Brian Smith, John Severe, who's fighting through the floor a little bit. You know, he was struggling to breathe, so we were running him and out, him and in and out. So, but those guys, if they're open, they're, you know, they're allowed to shoot the ball. How much longer will be in uh, conference play? Is a win like this do for you? That's good. I mean, it's our second good road win of the year. Uh, you know, we won a game at Manhattan, which was a good road win for us. So, anytime you win on the road, I don't care. I've coached you, we've won 25 games, and winning on the road is magic. You find a way to win. Someone else is able to win, especially when they take the lead twice on you uh, in the second half, like they did here. That's uh, that's tough. It's, uh, it's a good win. Thanks.